제 204회 누구든지 환영이죠. 안녕하세요. 반갑습니다. Welcome to Arirang TV's Let's Speak Korean. I'm your host Lisa Kelly and sitting next to me, also guiding you along, will be... Mm, thank you. 안녕하세요. I'm Stephen Revere and uh, we've got two students who just arrived back from a birthday. And look what's, what they're doing! What's up with that? <laughs> 안녕하세요. 여러분 안녕하세요. My name is Marina. Nice to see you again. <laughs> 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요 여러분. Nice to see you again. And by the way, their voices don't usually sound like this. They just drank a whole bunch of helium. Yeah, you didn't even do it right. That was still. terrible. I can Let's be better than that. Let's it, okay? Yeah. Okay, here we go. You gotta drink a lot of it. 안녕하세요 여러분. 안녕하세요 여러분. I <laughs> and uh, while, while, while they return to them their normal selves, well, here's our lesson for today. <laughs> Wrap it up with Lisa and Steven. 가입하고 싶은데요. 네, 그런데 혹시 새내기세요? 아닌데요. 신입생만 될수 있는 건가요? 아니요. 누구든지 환영이죠. 얼굴이 어려 보여서요. <웃음> okay, in today's dialogue, you may have noticed the sentences may not be so long, but there's a lot of words that you may not be familiar with. Stephen, you okay? Your voice over there? Yes, yeah, okay, I'm all better. <웃음> Making sure you're okay before I continue on. The first sentence was, 영미 생 가입하고 싶은데, 가입하다 means to register or to sign up for something. And I want to sign up for the Helium Club. Helium Club 가입하고 싶은데요. <laughs> yes. Last time we, club a 들다, right? Oh, 동아리에 들다. This time we've got uh, 동아리에 가입하다, which is another. We've, we've had eep before, haven't we? That's to enter something, right? To go into something. So 가입하다 is to enter, join a club. 가입하고 싶은데요. Adding that, that on to the end, what, what does this mean? Remember, now Jiwon and Young Mi aren't sitting there talking to each other. She's talking to someone that she doesn't know very well. So you, she uses that high form, looking for a response. That's right. She's talking to her sambe this time. And let's all practice. Let's pretend that there is, well, our Kishpan, our message board on Let's Be Korean, is in itself a club, right? So let's just say, Let's Be Korean, 동아리에 가입하고 싶은데요. Repeat. Let's speak Korean 동아리에 가입하고 싶은데요. Let's speak Korean 동아리에 가입하고 싶은데요. And if you have not come into our website yet, please do today, okay? <laughs> and the second line, 네, 그런데 혹시 신내기세요? Okay, this may be a word that you may not be familiar with. If you're attending a university in Korea like Marina and Arthur, perhaps you've heard it before. Have you? No. No? No. No? No? Okay. No. That word, senegi, senegi is another word for shinib sang. Oh, you know, you know what I didn't even confuse those two words and said it as one. <laughs> Shin is new, eep is koin, sang is student, so a new student, a freshman, is shinib sang. And this one, senegi, is the Korean word for that Chinese character word, right? Senegi. So he said, oh, are you a brand new student? He's guessing at something. Yeah. Hook she, hook she. You put that in just in front of something. When you're making a little bit of a guess, they're all hook she. Senegi, say it. Uh, Yangmi says, 아닌데요. No, I'm not a freshman or a newly uh, entered university student. 신입생만 들수 있는 건가요? Here's that new word that uh, Stephen just said earlier. Shinib Seng. Okay, Ip is to enter, as he said. So here, what would you be? To the person newly entering something, right? Mm -hmm. Look at the anindel. Look at this. See these ndes and the nindes are. What are they doing? You're being polite about certain things, right? This is the most common polite ending in Korean, it seems like to me. So she's. Oh, Anindeo, she's looking for more of a response. No, I'm not, but does that mean something, right? I want to know why you ask that. She says, then she says specifically what she's thinking. Now, we've had this before. The is a question ending, okay? So let's try repeating that. Shinipsengman들수 있는 건가요? 
신입생만 쓸수 있는 건가요? 네, and one more sentence using 신청하다, since this is another word meaning the same thing, ending with 건가요? 어디에서 신청하는 건가요? 어디에서 신청하는 건가요? 어디에서 신청하는 건가요? Where do I register for something? And our next line, 아니요, 누구든지 환영이죠. Okay, no, that's not true. Anybody can enter our club. And I like this word 환영하다 because it's a much uh, bigger, nicer word. It's kind of like saying, yes, thank you for that. And the higher or much nicer form would be, I really appreciate what you're doing for me. 환영하다 means welcome. 환영합니다. Mm -hmm. Welcome to wherever, right? Mm -hmm. So, 환영이죠. Mm -hmm. So, everybody's welcome to join, right? Right before that, you had 누구든지. Everybody. Everybody, what, yeah. everybody. We've had, this, we've had this a million times before, the dingies before, right? Where? 어디든지. Everywhere. And then, when? 언제든지. 언제든지. Okay, we've had, they go on and on, right? Right. Mm -hmm. And this last line we hear here, uh, just... One thing that Saint Tung Mechil just out of the blue for no reason he says, Orguri Audio Boyos, oh your face looks young. Audio boyda means to look young. He ref he's referring to what he said earlier. He's asking, Hey, are you a Tenegi? Are you a new newly entered freshman? So now he's explaining because your face looked young, by the way. That's yeah. why I asked. So let's try saying this. Marina and Arthur, you guys really look young, okay? Orguri Audio Boyos. 얼굴이 어려 보여서. 얼굴이 어려 보여서. Very good. All right, let's go on to Korean Insight. Korean Insight. And today we're going to talk about little Stephen Hexing <laughs> here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, long ago. Or, wow. so, some schools still do this. They put a little sign on you when you go to first grade in school. It says, 1학년, first grade, first class. Room, room one. Right. In, in, in America, we don't say, we say, like, Mrs. Kim's class, but here we say, first That's class, second class. Stephen. And underneath yeah. it, he has a hanky. What's that yeah. for? Yeah. yeah. Because uh, they like to slurp a lot. Mm -hmm. Yes. And, and uh, when they cross the street, they do this. And they cross the street. All the drivers stop to let the little kindergarten students. <laughs> They're pass. supposed to stop. Right. I think it's pretty crazy. The kids go like this, and then they just run right across the street and hope the cars are going to stop. But, it's a little but they dangerous. They do here. They yeah, do here. Yeah. And then finally, mm. Stephen Hexing, King Ralph, that is. Oh, you didn't even buy me a drink yet. What's that about? All right. Here in Korea, for anyone younger or even actually a little friend, uh, you can just say, "Oh, that is," and you. Tap them on their tush a little bit, on their behind. And uh, it just means, oh, you did a good job. Yeah, it's okay, but it's not so okay back in many other countries. And some Korean people have gotten in trouble, especially grandmothers, for giving too many taps to young children. Anyway, <laughs> let me go over the grammar really quickly. We had 가입하다. 가입하고 싶은데요. I want to sign up for the club. 새내기. New, say, new, senegi, new student, right? Freshman. Shneep saying, same thing. Uh, the question ending, is that the only way we can get in? And then, everybody is welcome. All right. Flash animation. Let's go take a look. <laughs> we talked about Shinip Seng and Senegi. And uh, do you know what the word is when you enter an office? If you're a first time employee, when you're a new employee at office, do you know what they call them? Shinip One? Shinip One, right? Or Shinip Sawan. Ip means to enter, yeah. right? So Sawan is also an officer or someone who works. So Shinip Sawan, very good. And I guess your next thing after you are a, a student, you will be a? Shinip Sawan, right? <laughs> Okay, thank you for joining us. We'll see you back here next week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.